What's up guys? Welcome back to a Build a Break Garage video and uh, it's been a while since I've seen you guys. Uh, I did shoot a video a couple months back and apparently I've lost all the footage. But it has been a couple months since I've last seen you guys and a lot has changed. The biggest changes have been mainly to the garage but uh, I can give you guys a quick update on Midori. She currently, uh, I don't know God, did I have the wheels the last time I did a video? I gotta check. All right, so I should give you an update on Midori. Uh, the last time you saw her, she had different wheels on. She was just freshly boosted, but uh, currently she's sitting in the garage and these are her new Rota form, or these are her new Rota Slipstream 17 by seven wheels. Uh, I decided to go white this time and uh, I can't say that I am not happy about it. I absolutely love the way this thing looks now. Definitely looks a lot better with the white wheels than it did with the purple wheels. The purple wheels came out like crap. She's still boosted and currently, uh, I mean, it's been handling the boost. It lasted all summer, so obviously I'm doing something right. Little update in the garage itself. I now have a TV in the garage, as you guys can see. That is a new addition that I just put in last weekend. So uh, this is the first time I'm actually out here using it. So we'll see how it works into the workflow. I'm kind of curious myself. But also, uh, one thing that you guys definitely don't know about yet, I mean, unless you guys follow me on Facebook, which most of you guys do, which I appreciate. But for those of you who don't know, I have purchased another car. Well, this isn't the best way to show it off to you guys. This is my 1996 Saturn SC2. Uh, as you can see, the pr former purple wheels went gold and it went onto this car. Uh, it has a Saturn Expression Series Ion wing. It has blast pipes also. And I even made my own front lip, even though you guys can't really see it because it's all covered in snow. And I dropped the car on the coilover from the turbo car. So that is now my summer beer. Uh, that's the car I'm going to drive in the summer when it's nice out, when I'm not driving Midori. Uh, it's just stock, everything else, everything else out of it is stock except for the suspension, wheels, and like the cosmetic uh, stuff of it. But other than that, the car just drives and it's, it gets phenomenal gas mileage and it's just fun. But, uh, today, uh, it, uh, obviously you can see we had a crap ton of snow, so Midori is officially parked for the year. Uh, that being the case, what I want to do is I want to take her all apart. Well, not like all apart. I want to take the wheels off, clean the inside of the wheels. Uh, I'm going to clean out the interior, clean everything up, get it all like super duper nice. I'm debating on painting the engine bay this year. I'm not sure. That won't be covered in this video. I, at least I hope not. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to get started on cleaning this bitch. And first things first, I'm going to have to start it because I want to move it over uh, from the uh, side of the garage so I can get all four doors open. So uh, cold start on uh, 98 Saturn SL2 with the turbo. off the ground got everything all taken apart but i got the first wheel all cleaned up it's all brand new again as you can see it looks all good and this one if i get close to it you can see it's all got a whole bunch of dirt all the way around it all on the inside so good thing we're cleaning this up so we can have a fresh start for 2020 you know first nice day of the year i'll be able to just pull the car out and drive not have to worry about cleaning it up or anything so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, continue to clean up some more and uh, enjoy this time lapse well like I said I got the first wheel all cleaned up and I was gonna put it on and then I realized that I probably should freshen up the wheel well so I took some truck bed coat and actually cleaned up all the black areas in the wheel well so now I have a nice fresh wheel well to put this nice new looking wheel on we get on to the next wheel so four one down three to go and four or er, second wheel done 
Got the wheel well super nice and black. Everything nice and coated, even all up top. So now to get the back wheel back on, and then uh, which as you can see is super nice and clean. I love these white wheels. Like when they're clean, they look so good. But keeping them clean is such a pain in the ass. This is the life when you choose to have white wheels, I guess. So uh, I'm gonna get this one on and then uh, start working on the front. Hi, well, I got all four wheels clean and got them back on the car. They look super nice and bright. The next thing up is getting all the exterior wiped down, getting the glass clean, and then uh, we move on to the interior. So uh, this part should go pretty quick because it's pretty straightforward. So. All right, guys, well, got the exterior all cleaned up and got it looking good. Got all the water spots off it and all the dirt, as you can see. She's all nice and clean. Even got the windows all nice and clean. Yeah, I was going to do the interior, but I just lost motivation. So I'm going to go ahead and take that for another episode. So thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, comment, share, subscribe, all that. And uh, we'll be definitely seeing you in the next one. Hopefully it shouldn't take us another six months. So sorry about that, but uh, thanks for being patient. So we'll see you later. Peace.